nearly half of the Western population reports bad quality of sleep or even lack of it, causing billions of dollars to their employers and to the society. The cost of sleep deprivation in the US alone is $400 billion yearly. In Germany, the same statistics is $60 billion. The effects of sleep deprivation are both cognitive and physical. It affects our ability, uh, ability to uh, be productive, make us more prone to uh, having diseases, or be us, uh, make us less productive. Companies such as Sleepio and Fitbit have been trying to solve this problem by providing you wearable devices and trackers and some general tips and, uh, and coaching on, your, uh, on how to change, change your habits towards better sleep. But that is not, that is not enough. That's why we are offering you Nuxo Sleep Coaching, personalized sleep coaching in a mobile phone. You can use it with your favorite de wearable device and start sleeping better now. It's not just some snake oil, but actually developed with leading sleep researchers in the field. M move to the demo. So we can start by, from scratch by uh, providing the data to the application. So we use Apple Health Kit, and then you can, you can do, choose your device, and then you can see the data, data already there. Based on the data, we assess your sleep coaching profile, and after that, you can start. You can continue to coaching directly. In the screen on the right on the right hand side, we can see a profile of a young professional who has a lot of all-nighters and an active social uh, social life during the weekends, causing a lot of social jet lag. With them, we are actually focusing on uh, focusing on making the making their sleeping patterns more consistent throughout the week and throughout the days. Then we move to the coaching. So the coaching is, uh, co coaching is based on lessons that are divided into weeks. And based on the lessons, you can, you can start creating habits with our help. Yes, as the weeks progress, we can actually, when we learn more, more from you, we actually can provide you more um, better coaching through that way. In the Nuxo cloud, you can actually see, see your data and uh, follow your coaching progress as well. Back to the presentation. So what we just saw, you can connect for your, with your existing data from your favorite tracker. You get a sleeping profile assessed by Nuxo, and then you can continue right to the coaching. The coaching program is built on sleep, uh, sleep research done by our researchers. They are doing research at, around circadian rhythm and homeostatic rhythms. We are focusing on mostly fixing your melatonin onset uh, in the nighttime and working around your natural circadian rhythm. Global market for sleeping aids is $50 billion. We are first targeting the European market, which is $15 billion. We are a bootstrapped company founded January of this year, and we've been building the product with the leading, leading and the biggest occupational healthcare provider in Finland and with, with a leading life insurance provider in Finland as well. Myself, I have a background in engineering. My co-founder uh, is a cognitive neuroscientist. Our head of coaching, a cognitive neuroscientist as well, is working very closely with our sleep researchers to make the coaching even better. If you're an employer looking to help your employees live, live a better life and be more proactive in the workplace, you can co contact us through email or visiting us at Startup Alley in, on our booth. Also, if, you are, if you're not getting enough from your tracker, you can actually download the Nuxo app now from the App Store and, download the co and purchase the coaching there. My name is Eva Siikaho. We are Nuxo. Thank you very much. Okay, judges. Uh, thank you so much. Um, and, and so and at Local Globe, we're both investors in, in an audio coaching app for, for running, as well as in Mind Candy that have a, um, t basically pivoted to, to focus on sleep with mm -hmm. Moshi Twilight for kids. So definitely understand that the space. Just curious how you think about developing and really transitioning and helping people you know, change their behavior with regards to sleep. Yeah. and the effectiveness of, of nudges, or how, how do you actually change behavior? Yeah. 
So the original research that whole app is based on is actually conducted at University of Helsinki, and there they developed this uh, coaching protocol that focused on this happy change, uh, almost like that's what, what it consisted of. And we actually took that and got rid of the psychologist doing most of the like motivational talk and that, stuff like that and turned it into mobile apps. So we already have proof from existing research that, hey, these things that we're providing here work. And this, this year we've been testing that with actually getting it to work so that we don't have the psychologists. The results have been pretty good. Yep. I'd be interested in, there's two questions. One of them, you're working with a health provider and the other one was, I didn't get that, an insurance company? Life insurance Life provider, insurance. yeah. Um, okay, my question, do you have a sense of data of the conversion rate of people that download the app that move to basically the, the coaching and then how much is the coaching cost? The coaching costs, it's eight euros now per month. Yep. Uh, we already launched, we did a soft launch earlier this year, so we don't have that, mu that much data. So we are, of course, of, of course working on that, convert converting them more. But we are working mainly with businesses, so they purchase, purchase for their either customers or employee, uh, employees the coaching. The coaching price is a little bit lower because we get a lot more users at the same time. And we also provide them with additional reporting, for example, so that you can see the whole organization, how well they're performing. So that's actually something that the business, the life insurance company and occupational healthcare, which we've been working with, that's what we've been like developing for them. And that's what they really like to see. And so far, the occupational healthcare, the pilot is just starting actually next month. Uh, the life insurance company that we built, uh, we piloted with, that went really well as well. So we actually got really good results, even though most of the users in that group that we tested it didn't have severe sleep problems. So most of them had some really minor stuff, but they most reported that it, that it did good results. They actually learned something new, and they were actually able to change their habits towards better as well. So that's interesting. So, so the eight euros a month, uh, are you charging that to the employers or to the end users? That's uh, that's for the customers. Uh, for employees, it's a little bit lower, uh, depending on how, how many people you enroll. Okay. So it's around for, from four, four euros to eight euros, like basically that. So do you see the, the go-to-market strategy here being primarily a B2C go-to-market strategy where you've got to market and create customer pull? Or is the challenge getting through to as many um, companies as possible, so they are, they are essentially your customers. We see that the business is the best potential, so we can actually show the results and the effects there the best. Uh, of course, consumer is, side is interesting, but because we decided to bootstrap, it was the hardest route, so we instead chose to talk to businesses directly, and that turned out to be a really good strategy, and we'll, we'll see continu continue doing that, but the consumer side will be there on the side as well, because it also helps us develop our product more towards the individuals who actually use it. So, When you're working with corporates, yep. where does privacy end? Mm -hmm. uh, in the sense of you're providing them a general analysis of the whole company, but then do you go into departments? Do you go into which people have signed up for the app? Where does privacy actually start and end for a single person, an individual? Yeah. We are uh, looking into that. Of course, we, we can't provide individual data to, to your employer or your life insurance pro provider. But uh, 20, 20 people is the minimum of g giving your, your group anal uh, analytics. And that's general, general analytics, not specific, specific individuals. So this is an incredibly crowded space. I mean, we were talking about some of the different solutions earlier. There's so many things that exist. Um, a lot of the teams that we see also doing these kind of projects, they have somewhat similar backgrounds. They bring in expert coaches and things like that. What do you guys think really differenti differentiates you from the other options on the market? Uh, what, what differentiates us is basically that we have the researchers in our own team. Uh, we have the founding team also has background from cognitive neuroscience, so the science part is really baked into it. And that by itself isn't enough. It's actually the data that we provide and we take in and combine those two to provide actually personalized. So as Eva mentioned, many of the current solutions don't really address that because they stay on a general level or there's no really scientific research based on that. So combining these two is actually has been the like key to talking to businesses and getting new customers interested. So that there, they don't just have that. I've been talking to a lot of our like wearable makers and they don't see this as something that they would start like doing now. I've been hearing that some of them, they, they are going to start, but 
in the last year or so, they've done nothing on this sector. So we don't believe them coming right away. And it's actually com surprisingly hard to build the coaching materials, which we've built ourselves. And what is the exit strategy? Uh, quickly. Quickly. Uh, let's see. We're now focused on selling the pro uh, building a good product and actually getting people to sleep better. We're more interested in that than getting this exit strategy at this point. But we can talk about that later uh, behind the stage, for example. And did you sleep well last night? <laughs> Pretty well. Pretty well, yeah. Hour. Seven right, cool. hours, yeah. yeah. <laughs> well awesome. done. Well, give it up one more time for Thanks. Nixo. Thank you.